Hey everybody, welcome back. As I mentioned at the outset of the program, it's been a fantastic week here on the Mountain Views show. Great music, great people from political candidates like Mike Weinholz to beautiful, talented actors like Chloe Farnworth. Amazing music right across the board. My homie Burnell Washburn, Folk Hogan in the studio tonight. But I gotta tell you, there's one fellow who's been on the show a number of times over the years, and man, he brings the inspiration like, I don't know if I know anybody else who makes me personally feel better just being in the presence of this guy. Oh yeah, and he happens to be one of the greatest skateboarders in the entire world, and a Laker, a Salt Laker, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> straight from the Vance Pool Party, my man, Jed Fuller! <laughs> yeah! I love Good you, man. Here, man. What's up? Just hanging out, man, hanging and banging. You Dude, know, you got a little thing. Dream. Tell us about the thing. Yeah, so... You see the, uh, uh, can we get it in the shot? I guess you can kind of see the boot. There's the boot. The boot. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I, I tore a ligament or some ligaments or something in my ankle. Um, Saturday will be four weeks, so I'm getting the boot off this weekend. Oh, good. And, uh, like, week and a half, I'll be back on my skateboard. Now, so. in the time that I've known you, I don't... I don't think I've known you to be injured. I'm sure you have bumps and bruises, right? Oh, but not this is... There you go. Get some wood on that. <laughs> I'll knock two. Uh, yeah, you know, I've been really fortunate. Um, I tried to do a lot of uh, prep, if you will. Um, so, you know, stretching, uh, workout, my diet uh, hasn't been great, but... Um, you know, I was looking at some pictures, though. I'll, I'm sorry, I'll interrupt you, but I was looking at some photographs on the interweb. Oh, yeah. And yeah. from... It's a, information it's information it's super so highway. Great. It's kind of new. <laughs> it's kind of new. Pipes and stuff. It's Man, weird. I haven't heard information super highway. Yeah, yeah. It's nicely deployed, by the way. Uh, <laughs> I was looking at I some do. photographs from kind of like back when we first met, and um, you're just in a, a completely different kind of body physical condition than you were three years ago, four years ago. Well, thank you. Um, I, yeah, you know, to do what I want to do and uh, well, to be where I'm at, to do and to go where I want to go, I should say. Um, it's it's all, all of it, right? I can't just go skateboarding and, and hope that that's enough, right? right? I've right. got to uh, eat healthy and, and work out and, and stretch. And, and, and neither can anybody else, whether it's Nigel Houston, who's yeah. you know, not a little yeah. kid anymore, but yeah. he's, you know, I mean. All See, those, a guys, those guys, yeah, a lot of those guys all have personal trainers right. and Absolutely. go to the chiropractor regularly and, um, you know, get pampered with massages and whatever. Person, well, and, so. and, and on some level they have to. I mean, not that, not that you yeah. don't incur some of those same yeah. injuries and just bumps and bruises, but when you think of a guy like Tony Hawk, who's literally been competing at a world-class level for almost 30 years. Yeah, probably more. Yeah, probably more. Probably more. No, yeah, because he was a big, it was a big deal. The, when he it's was actually the right now is the 30 year anniversary for the Bones Brigade, which was oh, uh, no that video, the search for Animal Chin. Yeah, sure. Uh, they actually <laughs> just <laughs> Animal Chin. Right? Have That's you funny. have you seen him, dude? Um, yeah, they just actually built a replica of that chin ramp at Woodward West, and it's been all the rage on the information superhighway. Yes, uh, it's yeah. it's taken over the Instagrams. Brought to you by as, Al Gore. As, <laughs> that's right. That's <laughs> right. Thank God for him. It's true. I mean, oh, man. there probably wouldn't even still be skateboarding if it weren't for Al Gore. I don't know about that. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Uh, Just like, yo, man, no jokes about skateboarding, I, I okay, man. I don't want. I don't want to get uh, dissed in the industry. That's get, right. That's I'll right. Get blackballed. Yo, Jed, I see you on yeah, TV talking about you. skateboarding, man. Al Gore, what? So, uh, so recovery plan. You get the boot off. And then, do you will you have PT? We have a, a rehab. Yeah, I'm, all, I'm actually already doing it. Um, I have some some stretches, uh, some balancing stuff. Um, I got a personal trainer I'm working with. Um, work with bands say, we, we and stuff like that. We had a hug like when I when you showed up. Uh, we had a hug, and I tell you, this guy is just get a little yoked. Hey. Got to do what Solid. you got to do. Got to do. Well, it really do. is though. So, I mean, you you think. Right, if you're a 15-year-old kid and you're just skateboarding for fun, but the level that you're at now, yeah. it really does require, because 
I'm sure when you get yourself in a competition situation, you're thinking only, I'm going for this run, you know, like this is it right here. Yeah, yeah, you, it's funny because you spend, at, at, when you're at a contest, um, you know, you usually get three 40 second runs, right? right and right. so you're literally skating, if you stay on for your full run, uh, what is that, 120 seconds? Um, Literally every second counts. Yeah, and so you're putting it all out there, man. I mean, especially, you know, the pool party and stuff like that. Right. You've got a, you know, the first place is $4,000. So, yeah, you're, I mean, those guys are putting it all out there, and you're sure. putting it all out there. And, yeah, you know, you want to be prepared. You want to make sure you can maintain the stamina and all sure. of that stuff because it's different you know when you go skating with your buddies or whatever you're out there for a couple hours yeah you you get worn out but in a contest man you're you're putting it all out there at the end of that 40 seconds that felt like 40 minutes it's tough right. yeah and on the third run and <clears throat> right, yeah. trying to make a score yeah on the third and yeah and then of course you for me for some reason i always back myself into a corner so that third <laughs> runs do or die and you know, fortunately, I'm blessed that I've been able to pull a few of them out. So. Well, maybe if uh, maybe if hashtag frontside Jed doesn't work out, you can just do uh, hashtag come from behind Jed. Hey, well, that could <laughs> well mean a couple things, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Hey yo. Hey yo! I did not mean it. Was, I was not making fun of skateboarding in any way. By yeah. the way, it was no, <laughs> it was no <laughs> deleterious <laughs> reference skaters. <laughs> <clears throat> Hey, let's take a break. We're going to talk about what's coming up. we got a little video we're going to watch. Yep, let's do What's it. Outside Jed, Jed Fuller in the house. Woo! We'll be right back after this. Woo! Welcome back. Woo! We're talking skateboarding. And woo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with my main man. He's on the sidelines for a minute, but he's going to be back, and he's going to be better than ever. Jed Fuller. Down but not out. DBNO. DBNO. <laughs> That's right. Hashtag DBNO. I had a buddy what, what? who used to do that. Like, if you would say anything that you thought was kind of a quippy quote kind of thing, like the other guy had to turn it into an acronym. So oh, you kind of awesome. get you kind of get used to hearing the uh, <laughs> DBNO. Hashtag DBNO. Jeff Fuller. I was like, dude, what is that what guy just talking? What's the what ball just, guy talking about, man? Well, uh, you're on the road to recovery. Yep. You were, we yep. were talking a little bit during the break. You got the trainer thing going, so you got really good professional advice on, on the kinds of things, to application-oriented yep. 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 exercise. What is that consisting of for you? I mean, obviously, you're slowed down a little bit, but um, what, what, is your, what does your workout consist of for skateboarding? So, uh, well, I'll throw a shout-out to my boy Trevor uh, taking care of me. That's right my Trev. personal trainer. So, uh, yeah, no, we do, Monday, I do Monday, Wednesday, Friday, uh, we go, I go to the gym, meet him at the gym, and uh, we'll do body uh, core, or, you know, upper body core, and then uh, legs, and uh, every day I get up, um, you know, I'm getting up early now, and uh, I get up and stretch for 10 to 20 minutes, and um, instead of, like, sitting on the sidelines at home you know most of the time the sidelines is the couch when i've been injured in the past this time right. i still go out to the skate park and film my buddies oh and, that's great man um, that's... i've actually taken a lot of uh i've taken this opportunity to like kind of refocus if you will and try to figure out what what it is that i can do to like get my message out there right like i want to give people hope i want uh, my kid sent me something for Christmas a few years ago. It was this art thing where they glued pictures on this canvas. And one of the things they put on there was a quote that said, live for greatness. And I love it. It's my motto. And so I want to encourage others to do that, you know. And uh, I've overcome a lot to get here, uh, to get where I'm at. Um, it's funny because I was thinking as I said that, to get here, where? Here? And yeah, here on this TV show even is you know, it was a bucket list, right? And sure, been on sure. here multiple times. But uh, go uh, follow me, uh, Frontside Jed, Instagram, Snapchat, uh, YouTube. Are you blowing Facebook. up Snapchat? I'm trying. I'm trying. Come I'm figuring on. it all out. They got. I think, uh, um, I think my Snapchat rating was negative four. Yeah, I don't even know what that means. It, I, I, I just, made it up. I just it's, know you. If if anybody were to to pay any attention to my really overall lack of 
Snapchat activity. <laughs> I just know it's big. Uh, it's a big thing right now, is, and so I'm yeah, trying to important. make it well, part of my. And I was amazed to to uh, see and talk a little bit about it at the beginning of the show that Vine is yeah, done. I mean, crazy. there are people That's for whom Vine was kind of their entire life. Yep. I mean, a yep. lot of, and yep. I say kids, young people, but I mean, people across all kinds of demographic categories really made a, a name for themselves. And of course, it's not that those people aren't migrating right. or haven't already migrated to other platforms, but it still is just that yeah. thing of like it's the crazy. six second video right. was, like and if you can make a, an impression that, in six seconds, whether huge. it be to laugh or to yeah. whatever, yeah, huge. there's a talent there, but times change and they sure have on to the new. Hey, you got some video. What are we going to watch? Yeah, so this is uh, I've got a new sponsor here. The, my most recent sponsor, Triple Eight Helmets. Uh, they're out of New York City. What up, Brian? Triple Eight. Uh, and this is a little video I made. A welcome to the team edit. Nice. Um, so, yeah, cue it up. Yeah. Dude. Yeah, so there you have it, man. Uh, that nice was this work, summer, man. sometime. My buddy, uh, my buddy's backyard, just killing. Throwing it. a lot of air out of that coping, man. Just trying to make it happen, dude. Just. What's up I next for it. you? I, I mean, besides it. kind of getting back in the game, what's what's going to happen next? Uh, you know, I'm really focusing on my social media. I'm going to start doing some uh, motivational videos of like sharing my story, what I've overcome, That's what's awesome, worked for me, and. Uh, you know, hopefully um, encourage some people. Um, you know, hopefully this time next year we're talking about my book, and uh, we'll go from there, man. Awesome, man. That's so great. Yeah. Want to shout out all my sponsors? Yeah, let's do the sponsor so, uh, thing, bro. Yeah, so I had to write them down. Embassy, what up, Lee? Ace Trucks, Bones Wheels and Bearings, go get you some. Roll with the best. Nice. Uh, Roadkill Hardware, my boys back uh, back east there in Georgia. Boneless Skate Products, Yeah Park, Butler Racing. Triple uh, Eight, we just saw the video. Protect your brain. Van Shoes, uh, Griffin, thanks for taking care of me. Gertz and Clothing, get you some Skater Dad gear. Uh, that'll help me, me travel around the world, by the way, so go support me. Uh, the Cassette Company, uh, my sunglass sponsor, Wicked Audio, and Milo Sport, The Fam, I love you guys, and of course, my inspiration, my kids, Mads and Abby, I love you guys. <laughs> Woo! Yes, I'd like to take a chance to give a shout out to all my sponsors. <laughs> Yes. Jed Fuller, everybody. Woo! So great to see you, my brother. Oh, I love you, man. Thanks, I feel you better too, man. in my heart good, after dude. we've hung out every good. single time. Best wishes for speedy recovery. Thank you. And continue on world domination. You're a huge inspiration to me and so many other people. And it's great to see you here. We always appreciate you take time for Park Thank City you. Television. Love being here, man. All right, you guys. We're going to take a break. We are going to do a quick weather. And then the second half of the show is just a barrage of musical beauty. The mighty, mighty Folk Hogan right after this. <laughs>